So you might be trying to figure out how you can close applications on watchOS 10. Now Apple has changed this with our Apple Watches now, so it is kind of funny, I don't know why they did this, but within watchOS 10, it's a little bit of a different process. So before, in order for us to actually go ahead and close applications, we had to double click or like side click the specific side button right here in order to actually get into our applications. But now, instead of using this bottom button, we now use our digital crown. So in order to actually get into those you know, applications we have in the background on stock watchOS, you want to double click your digital crown. So when you double click your digital crown, you will see all the applications that you basically have inside of your Apple Watch. So now you can see all the past you know, Apple applications that you've used on your Apple Watch. And if you're not familiar, what you can do is you can swipe to the side and you can exit out of your applications just like this. So you can just keep going, whichever applications you no longer need, you can just swipe out just like this. And that is basically it. And at the end, you can just, you know, you'll see recently used applications are here. And that's basically how it's done. Now, the reason Apple switched it this year is because when you click on this side button, it now brings you into your control, whatever this thing is, control center. But also now if you double click it as before, it brings Apple Pay. So now that's basically how Apple did it. Because now when you swipe up, it just brings you into your widget panel. <laughs> so it's kind of all over the place. Before, if you swiped up, you got into your control center. Now you basically get into your control center by clicking this bottom button right here, or this side button right here. So that's basically how it's done. Super basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.